statements. Member from New York Southwestern. Well, thank you, Mr. Speaker. I am pleased to rise in the House to speak about the Albanian Canadian Community Association in my riding of York Southwestern. Immigration to Canada began in the early 20th century, and today there are over 28,000 Albanian Canadians in Ontario. This community has made and continues to make important contributions to the growth and prosperity of the province of Ontario. November is a significant month for the Albanian community. Each year, people of Albanian origin celebrate the Albanian Declaration of Independence, which declared Albania an independent, sovereign nation on November 28, 1912. That is why, Mr. Speaker, I will be introducing later a bill to declare November as Albanian Heritage Month in Ontario. Oh, right on. Albania also commemorates Liberation Day, which is the day that Albania was liberated from Nazi Germany forces after the Albanian resistance on November 29, 1914. The Albanian Canadian Community Association has supported the community for 25 years since November 4, 1990. The association commemorates the history and celebrates the rich traditions of Albanian heritage and should be proud of the work that they do. <clears throat> Mr. Speaker, I would like to thank <clears throat> Dr. Ruki Kondai wow, in particular for her tireless work and dedication to the Albanian Canadian community through her work as honorary president of the association. I believe it's important to remember our heritage and I feel an affinity to this community not only because of my last name but also because of similarities with my own heritage. Congratulations to all Canadians of Albanian heritage. <laughs>